It is time for a scare in this morning's cruising Connecticut. Be prepared. The Creporium Haunted House in Hamden is a 3,000 square foot home of horror. Yeah. News says Ryan Christopher is here with a first hand look. Were you scared, Ryan? Good, good morning. Yeah, I, I think we're creeping Connecticut this morning. Something <laughs> yeah, like that. We are, that. and we're scared. Uh, well, well, you you should be because I'm I'm a little upset actually. First, I thought we were doing a story about Halloween makeup, uh, guys, and then I walk into this. Welcome to Creeporium. A reason to fear the dark. Quite a scary experience. Well, it's my job to be scary. It's a fact. If I'm not scaring the bejeebies out of you, it's, I'm not doing my job. <laughs> well, you, you sure did do that. Now, I, I have to ask you, how, how long have you been doing this for? Technically, 30 years. I had no choice to give up my other business, just making novelty toys and just focus on Halloween 100%. A lot of haunted houses in Connecticut right now, not all of them, but uh, many of them are outdoor haunts. <laughs> Here, it's everything is more condensed, more claustrophobic. It's more of a circus, a kind of entertaining. <laughs> it's very intense, so be prepared for not relaxing. So in the minute you go in to the time you leave, you're not, you're not concerned about how long it takes you to get through you, you're concerned about how to get out. I like scaring adults. This pressure's on your face. I, on my face? Why are you making it so personal? <laughs> I got you. <laughs> Last weekend, we actually had uh, some people walk through, and one of the ladies uh, urinated. Uh, and she told us it was that scary, so she was very appreciative. Well, be sure to bring your depends, I guess. Get me out of here. Somebody help. Come on. <laughs> Made it back a lot. Intense. Yeah. No, did they actually give you a flashlight? I mean, does everybody get one? No, or did you? No, we, we, we brought one because it was oh, so you dark in there. One. Yeah, and okay. for, for you guys to see anything at home, we we had to bring one. So, uh, quite the creepy experience. They were popping it up is. everywhere. Yeah, and, and, and the first time, you, you know, before we actually shot the segment, he said, hey, let me walk you through. And all of a sudden, there's clowns popping. I said, hey, buddy, e easy. <laughs> this is just uh, for, for TV. You don't have to actually scare me. We're just. But they wanted you to get the to, full effect. The well, key with haunted houses is you go with a group of friends and then you push some of them up front. First, ah, so that's they how it get works. everything and, firsthand. And then when so. they start screaming, then you scream too. Yeah. Right? Well, it's, it sounds like you guys have done this a time or two, Brian. Uh, not ahead. this have one. Have you pushed people forward in, in your life? Yes. At if she's or... watching, our, my friend Charlene, we always push her first. Charlene. So poor Charlene Sorry, Anderson. Put up All right, right. Very good. <laughs> 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 Looks like a lot of fun, though. Oh, tons of fun. Make sure you guys check out Creeporum in Hampton. It's open through the end of Halloween. All right. Yeah. Good to know. Thank you, Ryan. And we are.